Well, I don't agree with Dr. O on this point. Um, it is indeed the fact that uh, we are following Israel. Israel is not following us. Israel has done us no favors. Um, it has uh, thoroughly discredited itself and us. Uh, it has cost us a great deal of money, but more important, it has cost us global prestige and influence. And we look uh, impotent. Uh, Joe Biden, our president, repeatedly tells Israel not to do things. They go ahead and do them. This is a longstanding pattern. That was the pattern with George W. Bush, for example. Don't go into Janine, and Ariel Sharon then did, and, um, and so forth and so on. So uh, we are being discredited in many ways, morally, of course, because we, are support, we have supported genocide. Now we're supporting mass murder in Lebanon uh, and assassinations and acts of terrorism, like uh, state terrorism, like the uh, pager uh, and uh, walkie-talkie uh, explosions. And, um, uh, but we have, are also losing prestige in terms of credibility in our ability to lead. Uh, we clearly have no such ability. Uh, Israel has erased our influence in the Middle East. I don't know of any country there now that is happy with our actions. Um, people in the region are realists. They recognize that we are militarily powerful, but we are diplomatically now essentially disarmed. 